In this problem, we're being asked to find the average rate of change of a function from its graph. And you know, the, the, the average rate of change is like a calculation of slope. So you're going to have two values, x1 and x2. In this case, we've got 0 and 2 as the values they're giving us. And we're going to put the rise over the run, basically, from those two points on this function. The rise are the y values or the function values. So you'd have g of x2 minus g of x1. So the difference between the y values or the function values. And on the bottom, you'd have x2 minus x1, or the, uh, the, the run, the difference in the x values. So let's see if we can plug those in here. Um, well, the bottom is easy. x2 is 2, and x1 is 0. So we have 2 minus 0 on the bottom. We need to figure out the function values for x1 and x2. x1 is 0, so what's the function value when x is 0? Looks like the function value is 1. So this one is um, 1. And then x2 is 2. And at 2, whew, it goes all the way up to 16. So we've got 16 minus 1. So this is 15 over 2 or 7.5. So the average rate of change of this function from this interval from 0 to 2 is a slope of 7.5. So that is how to find the average rate of change from a graph of a function.